Okay, so my notes about myself in that first video, that 12 things about me, which I can tell y'all are loyal and faithful already because y'all are just commenting and liking away and completely just ignoring the fact that I was being absolutely extra in that first video. I mean, I literally said, I'm so excited. Like, it's so embarrassing. I watched it back, I'm like, no, no, <laughs> what are you doing? Um, but it's fine because you're back, so that means you like something about it. And this video, see, I'm already ruining it again. So, y'all, okay, before I started this video, I had two notes for myself for the first video, okay? I said, I'm so excited too much, so I said, I'm not gonna say that this time, and I almost said, I'm so excited already, so fail. The second thing is, I knew I was posting a 20 minute video as the first video, and I was like, girl, you're doing the, the most. I mean, literally, I just wanted to give y'all my whole life story in the first video. So, this one I told myself I'm sticking to under 10 minutes, if not shorter than that. Who thinks I can do it? If you said you think I can do it, you don't know me. <laughs> okay, no, for real, we're gonna try this out. So, already have like, oh my gosh, a minute and some down. So, this video, I am stepping out on a ledge. And I promise you, if I step out on this ledge and y'all play me, ooh, I'm taking the video down. I'm just, y'all won't get no other privileges if you ruin this for me, okay? I'm going to share with you cringy, cringy, I mean cringy, old photos of me throughout the years that I would like to pretend are gone and buried in treasure chests. I've locked almost all my old albums on Facebook where these photos can be found because it's just that bad. So a few ground rules, okay? The comments better be nice. <laughs> Y'all better not come for me because actually I was very kind and cut a few people out of these, cropped them out of these photos so that they would not be exposed in their rough stages as well. I decided to only allow myself to be clowned. So y'all better trend lightly because some of y'all that might have a comment, I might have a picture of you as well that I could have posted in my did So be nice. We all had our rough stages. The other thing I want to mention is that like 14 year olds, I'm gonna even say like 10 year olds to 14 year olds in 2018 compared to like 10 to 14 year olds during like my age of 10 to 14 a decade ago. Completely different. I mean, just, wow. <laughs> um, they make us look like we were just out here looking busted and disgusted. Those are just all my disclaimers that I feel like we need to get out the way so that y'all don't clown me in this video. Like I said, play nicely or else I'm not sharing nothing else with you, okay? I'm allowing you to laugh with me because I'm gonna laugh at myself as well, but just calm down, okay? Don't come for me too hard. So, wow. So the first picture I thought I would start off cute and light and fluffy, okay, and post a little baby picture. It's still kind of clowning myself because... No. <laughs> no. He wasn't ready. This bonnet. I just want to know who did this to me. Like, I literally look like Grandma Mabel in this photo. Like, it's so cute. because My cute little butt nose, my little cheeks. But why they got me wrapped up in this towel, standing with this bonnet, looking like I'm 85, stuck in a two-year-old's body? I don't understand. I don't understand who allowed me to look like that. But I'm cute, so it's fine. Okay, now let's get into some... Y'all be nice, okay? Just be nice. No! God, please, no! No! So this was our eighth grade trip. <laughs> This is our 8th grade trip to, it was like D.C., Gettysburg, a whole bunch of random places. So I was in private school at the time. I was only in private school for two years and that life was not for me, okay? But this is our 8th grade class trip. Yes, those are extensions in my hair. Those are long, flowy, braided extensions. I'm so glad I didn't I didn't do a close-up picture on purpose because I mean my shout out to my mom because this is what I wanted and she gave it to me okay she was my hairstylist but the fact that I even asked for this at the end, and it was like that thick like not the flowy okay it's like the ends was thick okay they just was Woo! 
Woo! My lord. Yep, and the sunglasses. I always had somebody's sunglasses on my head. I mean, they were always mine, but just why? They were always big and bodacious and doing too much. And the rolled up sleeves, do y'all see this? I would put any two shirts together and roll the sleeves up. I used to match it. So see how there's kind of blue in that shirt? I was literally trying to match that with this dark navy blue t-shirt. I cannot explain myself, okay? So don't ask. What else should I do? Oh my god. You know, I can't really explain this. Okay, yes I can. Wait a minute, wait, wait a minute. The long dangly earrings. Y'all see these sunglasses. What was my choice, my selection of sunglasses? I feel like some of these were my mom's. Like, what was I doing, y'all? Hell, Lord. But this was Yeepaw 2008. Ooh. Yeepaw is like this huge thing in my hometown. And every year, the colors for the year are like, ooh, the Yeepaw colors. And it used to be a really big deal back then. And as you can see, I took it a little bit too seriously. And the rubber bands for my braids, them half braids, come on. The rubber bands are the colors of me. And I tied up my, y'all see it. Okay. See, I threw this in here, I think, as a buffer too, even though I'm still clowning myself. Because why is that beehive bump on my head? What are you doing? Wow. What are you doing? So there's no reason for me to have a bump on my head. I'm pretty sure that was out by then. And I had like the twisties on the side, the swoop. This is all my hair by the way, okay? I was Drake City back then with my relaxer. That's all my hair. But child, it was just, why? The curls, the swoop, the twist, and the bump. Did we need all of that? This is freshman year homecoming, y'all, and I just knew I was killing it. Now who remembers Oh my gosh, who remembers Picnic? Picnic used to be this thing online where you could upload your photos and edit them. I didn't even put the worst of the worst. These are pretty bad, but I was too embarrassed to put the worst ones because I'm like, okay, I'm in a professional field right now. Like, I'm in graduate school. I cannot have these pictures just out here for people to see. I just don't think people need to see these. I literally have one where I wrote the lyrics to, um, Oh, you fancy, huh? Like, on the photo. Oh my gosh. Y'all, for all of these, I just want to say, let me explain. I'm just so embarrassed. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> so those are colored, bright neon colored headbands, probably from Claire's. I doubled them up. Who does that? I put that bump, that sharp bump, in my own hair with bobby pins. I had the twiggies. I used to love pulling down them, them, them slick, straight edges. Y'all see how greasy and flat my hair is. Woo! What? I... Relaxer days. But my hair was long, as you can tell, but just hot mess. Then I got the colored earring thing. No, I do not wear prescription glasses at all. Those are probably from Claire's. Non-prescription. Why do you have square lenses on that are like this? Are you 85? And that is definitely a graphic tee, zebra print. Graphic tee. I think it says peace in different neon colors and it's zebra print. Did any of us have friends back then? I just, did anyone have a friend? Phone a friend. Oh. Oh. I almost didn't put this one in here. I didn't, I, I didn't want to. This was my sweet 16, which I planned all by myself and was completely, absolutely extra. I mean, if you look at my jewelry, y'all, I have big, you can't tell, but they're big like flower studded, like fake studded earrings, okay? Then I have this like black beaded with this big, oh you can't even see it in this picture. I, I should have got a different picture. But it's got this big like tin foil like flower on it. So earrings that. My mother finally let me get acrylic nails and I went and of course got the exact colors of the dress. Who does that? <laughs> Who does that? So my nails are literally turquoise with random like ratchet designs on them. I can't explain. 
I can't explain. Then you have the black and silver bangles with this dress that was all red, like the teal bow. I was 16. There is no excuse for this attire. Every person that showed up to this event and didn't escort me in the bathroom to take off some of this jewelry. Help me. Help me. Just like, oh, I also have a big tin flower ring on. And the tiara, which was my friend's cotillion tiara that she allowed me to borrow, which has pearls in it. I'm sick. I'm literally sick that y'all let me look like this. Or that I did this to myself because it's, it's really just my fault. <sighs> so I had to redeem myself. I just needed a relief. So I figured I would show you all one of my senior high school pictures. This makes me feel better about my life to know that I promise y'all was not ugly all the time. Like I really did have highlighted moments where it was like, yes girl, you're doing okay. But I did go through some some rough phases. But this was a good moment. This was a highlight, okay? Y'all see I had just got some little fresh color. leaned on the wall, my model status. I really enjoyed this picture, so put it in here for some relief from the distress of those other photos. So I'm gonna end with this photo because I just want everybody to know <laughs> that she made it, okay? I did not stay in the sunken place. I found a way out, okay? I saw the light eventually and it's all good. So that's all I have for you today. Hopefully I was able to edit this video down to about 10 minutes. Ooh, fingers crossed. But nonetheless, I am so happy to share this with you guys. I hope you got a good laugh off of my trash photos. I'm hoping you guys decide to stick around for future videos. If you do, please, 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 please click the subscribe button and also turn on the notification bell so that you know when I post videos next. You don't want to miss out when I post videos. So wait, before you go, you have to leave me a comment and let me know which picture was your favorite. Go easy on the comments, okay? So don't bake me or anything. And don't forget to leave me a like so I know you like this video and everybody else knows you like this video and I know what kind of content you guys enjoy and know how to do better for you guys in the future. So make sure you leave a like, make sure you leave a comment, and I will see you guys in the next video.